Piece by piece, a group of volunteers are working to keep the streets of Vermont's capital city litter free. But as Local 22's Spencer Conlin found out, they are focusing on a certain piece of trash that should be recycled. We meet every week, and this is the end of our fourth year. They call themselves the Trash Tramps of Montpelier. It was just something kind of fun to do, you know, and a lot of them are plays on words. Like that's perky pickup over there. Equipped with bags and tongs, the group deploys every Tuesday from the Montpelier Senior Activity Center on Berry Street. It's a, a spiritual practice. You know, it's caring for the earth. In the beginning, the volunteers would pick up all the trash they could find, but quickly realized something was being overlooked. Cigarette butts. You know, drop your butt on the sidewalk, it's going to get washed into the storm draining, therefore get in the river. Ferguson so says the self proclaimed tramps collect three to four thousand butts a week. Let's do the math. That's more than 800,000 butts since the group was formed in 2014. They're always like, how come we got so many butts coming out of Montpelier? <laughs> but it's, a, it's not because we're really big smokers here. It's because we have a system in place to collect them. The group brings the butts to the Central Vermont Solid Waste Management District. We ship them to TerraCycle, who then coordinates um, the recycling of those items. It turns out when processed, the paper and tobacco is separated from the filter and and compost it while the filter is recycled into plastic pellets. To use for um, plastic um, pallets for industrial uses, but also for like plastic uh, park benches and outdoor furniture. And it's all work that does not go unnoticed in the capital city. You are, you are the good sage. I'm glad you're on TV. Spencer Collin, a local 22 News, Montpelier.